Hey guys, uh, Daniel Bergman, Fly Dressing here. Today we're gonna tie a imitation of a dead long legs, uh, which is sort of a last resort pattern of mine. Fish doesn't that often become that super picky on, on, on this kind of flies, but it's a good, good one to have uh, in the bottom of the box when you've tried everything else. You toss one of these out and quite often they actually uh, step up and take it. The rear body on this one, I make uh, out of uh, Tiemco Aero Dry Wing, which is a uh, synthetic yarn with air channels in it, uh, which makes it float really well. Um, so it's a good, good uh, material to use both for wings and for extended bodies. The hook I'm going to use is a RX uh, Super Dry in size 12. A really good uh, all round hook for um, patterns with extended uh, bodies, both foam and yarn or polish and or whatever you want to use.
<coughs> there you have it, more or less. Uh, I'm just gonna trim the wings. What I did uh, with the deer hair is uh, I sort of hurried a little bit. Just trying to, to make uh, the deer hair looks, uh, legs uh, look a little bit more natural with, with a lot of joints. Um, when it comes to the length of the wings, I want to have them sort of uh, the same length as the rear body. But since they're placed a little bit further up front, uh, they're not all the way back, uh, back to the end of the rear body. Okay, and just to give it a little bit more life, I'm gonna just slightly touch it with the marker. Uh, quick and easy, uh, daddy long legs imitation. Uh, few materials, uh, floats really well. Uh, sort of ticks all the boxes uh, I want fulfilled to have a place in my fly box. And if you want to win this fly, uh, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and leave a comment down below here. Maybe you can try this uh, during your summer's adventures. Cheers!